everyone, Tetra Kitty 5 here, and you know what day today is? Today is Retro Wednesday, and we are going to be playing Earthworm Jim for the Sega Genesis. And you guys are probably wondering, well, for those of you that may or may not already know, but I did have a Retro Wednesday about a half an hour ago. I was playing Space Invaders, but that video ended up being only six minutes long because, for whatever reason, my game stopped re responding to my Super Nintendo console. So instead of only having one six minute long episode this week for Retro Wednesday, I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a bonus and I'm gonna be playing Earthworm Jim for the first time for you all. I'm sure a lot of you guys have already played this, but this will be my first time playing this game. But before I do start, hope you guys are having a, 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 a fantastic Wednesday so far. Hope you guys are doing well. And hope you guys will enjoy this bonus Retro Wednesday episode. Since I did feel bad that the last one that, like I said, was about half an hour ago, was only six minutes long. And I figure you guys deserve more than that. So, but without further ado, let's check out Earthworm Jim. Made back in 1994. Okay. New Junk City. Okay, this is a demo, by the way. This is not me playing. They really should have demo flashing up on the thing. That way we know for sure. Okay. Okay, options. Normal. Practice normal. Okay. Practice. We'll do normal. Okay, New Junk City. Okay, looks like we're not... Oh, cool. Okay, I need to get used to the controls, though. Oh, crap. Cow launched. Oh, there's a limit on how many... Oh, I wanna... I wanna get down there. There we go. Okay. I didn't realize there was a limit on am ammo. I'm gonna have to be mindful of that. I hope if I push the right button. Okay. 
Okay, this could be a bit of a thing. There we go, we managed to get that. Awesome. Okay, checkpoint. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna go ahead and create a suspend point here. Okay, this is a weird game, but I'm kind of liking it so far. Okay, let go of me. Oh crap. Oh Jesus. That yeah, that's okay, that's a lot of nonsense right there. Give me a freaking break with that. Let go of me! Okay, let's... Get... Could use my whip. There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay. Be amazing if I get past this first level. Okay, I need. Okay, I need health and I need ammo. Okay, this dog is kind of checking me off a little bit now. These enemies are getting on my nerves. Get off of me! Okay, that's how you do that, I guess. What am I? Am I really supposed to shoot my way over there? Oh, what? Get up there! Oh! What the heck? There we go, and there's some ammo right there. Okay, nice. Okay, let's go ahead and create another suspend point. This is not a bad game, but I can see where it could be warning. Okay. Uh, yeah, like I was supposed to anticipate that.
Okay. Okay, that... Okay, this game's starting to do my head in a little bit now. to dodge these how yeah how am I supposed to dodge those Is it really gonna shoot Andros until I take damage? Yep. even care at this point. Yeah. Yeah, that's it for Earthworm Jim. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to look up exactly what I'm gonna what I'm supposed to do though, but I mean I was having fun for like the first half that level and the second half that level just got kind of ridiculous. But anyway that is Earthworm Jim. This is my first time playing the game. I'm not sure I probably won't be playing this game again anytime soon, but at least I got to play the, try this game out. I'm sure a lot of you guys have already played this, but, um... But yeah, it's a mixed bag. I just feel that they really didn't... Here's another level, which I probably will never get to, but we'll just go ahead and check this out here real quick before I end the video. But I hope, despite my gameplay, you guys enjoyed watching this, and hope you guys have a good Wednesday. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. Which, I don't know why I said it like that, but... Just check out this level here real quick. Looks like it could be a fun game if I knew exactly what I was supposed to do on it. Not a problem. Well, let's just go ahead and check these out. Even though I'm not playing this. Okay, that looks- that level looks like some bull bull, as the Ashy Games would say. So, you're supposed to get and destroy that thing before you leap. 
your rope goes out. For Pete's sake. This game's got good music at least, the graphics look good. Gameplay, can, I think, can be fun. Like I said, I still gotta figure out what exactly what I'm, what all I'm supposed to do here. I'm not sure what planet that's supposed to be in the background. If it's even supposed to be a planet that we're supposed to know. But even though I'm not playing this anymore, at least you guys are getting to see, which I'm sure a lot of you have already played this and have already played these levels, but... I'm just seeing this for the first time. That looks like a lot of nonsense. But real nice. I hope this doesn't take place in the butt, uh, or if so, then somebody needs to really go to a proctologist. And you're supposed to go through that without taking damage? A rather visceral looking level. Nice to know that the computer has issues with this too. Level 5. Okay, what is that? Seriously, what is that? Yeah, I'm kind of having fun just watching this if I'm being honest. Because I'm kind of curious what's all in this game. you guys are getting a much longer video than the previous one I did with Space Invaders for the Super Nintendo. So at least this makes up at least a little bit for that. Down the tubes. levels are in here. Okay, this looks like Metroid Fusion and the, the underwater sector of the space station. How many levels are in this game? I'm kind of curious. Okay, what is that, a gerbil? I guess, I don't know. And it's eating everything. Doesn't seem to like earthworms, thank goodness. See, this game looks cool because it has, like, no two levels look identical. You get, like, different uh, styles of gameplay for each video. Andy Asteroids? Okay. Okay. Yeah, this game looks like it can be cool, which is, I just need to figure out how to play it. Because, like I said, this is the first time I've played this game. I might have to give this game another shot. I don't know if there are any cheat codes or anything that will let me play to different levels, but I might have to try that in the future, I don't know. So apparently that was a race. And that must be all there is. Is that, is that all there is? Where's that all the levels? Let's just see here real quick. Yep, that, that has to be. Okay. But there we go. There's a little bit of uh, what Earthworm Jim has to offer. 
But thank you guys again so much for watching this, and I will see you guys again next time.